Hello, my name is Bob Walzer and I'm going to be showing you today an adaptation of the Abram Morris dance that you can do in your dining room or your living room or even outside if you like. The dance uh, is based on a dance that's done in the village of Abram, which is near Manchester in England. Uh, but in the Midwest, which is where I am right now in Minneapolis, uh, there's a local adaptation of the dance. In England, it's usually done the whole dance to a skipping step. In Minnesota, we walk through much of it. Uh, and the tempo is a little different. So we're going to kind of do a mini Midwestern adaptation of the Abram Circle Dance here today. To do it, there's only really two little bits that uh, uh, I'd like to teach you before we actually start the dance. The first one is that there's often a flourish that comes at the end of the phrase. If you count five, six, seven, eight, and... And there's a, a, a flourish with your hankies. Five, six, seven, eight, and. And then you do something. That'll happen a bunch of times in the dance. The other one is that we'll, uh, in the middle of the dance, there's uh, two moments when you're going to do a wave and bow. Just two little circles. Circle and bow. And that'll happen a couple times. With that much introduction, I think we can try the Morris dance. Mostly it's going to be walking. In a, we would be walking in a great big circle if we were outside, but you can just do it in place. And you can just do your hankies if you like, or you can step. Or if you're feeling frisky, you can even skip. Yeah, whatever you like. All right. I'm going to just kind of sing the tune along and show you how the dance goes. And we'll start with that walking in a circle. And it goes, for you of the Abram Morris dance. 